I think the only question that ought to matter to a voter is, is this guy a Hall of Famer or not? Not how does he fit into my top 10? We're closing in on the 2014 Baseball Hall of Fame announcement, and today a Dodgers beat reporter with the name of Ken Gurnick came out with his ballot. All the MLB.com writers' ballots were released to the public and said that he only voted for Jack Morris. He referenced the fact that Jack Morris was an ace for over a decade and then said, during the period of PED use, I won't vote for any of them, saying that any player who's played recently on the ballot, he won't vote for. Here's the problem with Gurnick's ballot, and there are a lot of problems with it, but Glavin and Maddox were guys that made their livings off of 88 mile an hour fastballs. They were the best pitchers of the last 20 years, but they should not be categorized with guys like Sosa, Bonds, and McGuire. They're Hall of Famers, it's not deniable, and they were not PED users. I would beg you to offer a different perspective on those two pitchers. So this seems a little silly to me that you leave them off just to make the point that you don't approve of PED use when these two guys are not guilty of it. What do you think? Do you agree with his ballot? Do you disagree? And in which case you would agree with me. Tweet at Doug Williams, yes, or leave a comment directly below on YouTube, and we'll talk about it.